Ah, the prestigious Yuva Academy, leading the way into the future whilst value valuing our individuality. Located in the upcoming Paldea region for the ninth generation of Pokemon overall. And on that note, welcome everybody to my newest Let's Play series for my channel. And yes, your eyes do not see you. Pokemon Violet has officially landed onto the channel. Uh, yeah. When given the choice between Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet, I instantly chose Violet because I definitely like the look of all the futuristic, uh, all the futuristic ish Pokemon that was featured on the cover of uh, the game. And I'm wondering if uh, that theme is going to be continued onwards in, or the further we travel into the game. However, I should point out, ladies and gentlemen, I have actually done two separate off-camera um, playthroughs for Pokemon Violet. And before I was thinking of bringing Pokemon Violet to the channel, and I was I was actually brainstorming to myself, how can I actually make this a bit different to, compared to my other two playthroughs? So, you know, may try and make them stand out. And then about a week or so later, I had the infamous light bulb moment and my playthrough is going to be as, as such i'm actually going to be using this as my prediction for the pokemon team of one of the new protagonists for the pokemon horizons uh, for the upcoming pokemon horizons anime so, seeing as how one of them's already been um revealed we'll we'll know which one I'm going to be starting with, which is going to be none other than the grass Pokemon, Sprigat. I forgot the name of the grass Pokemon already. Also, I do want to point out that my off-camera playthroughs for Pokemon, Vi for Pokemon Violet, I have actually chosen the fired Pokemon, Fue Coco. Almost forgot how to pronounce the thing then. And here we are at the main house of the protagonist for the Pokemon Violet game. So let's get up and see what's uh, what's what downstairs, ladies and gentlemen. And I do apologize if you do hear me. My uh, voice level is a bit low. I am dealing with it just a tiny bit of a sore throat. Nothing, nothing major. I am staying hydrated, so no, no need to worry about that. A squavet really in the Paldea region. I thought I left those behind in the Gala region. Just making sure I'm staying hydrated. The mother of the protagonist. Let's see what she has to say. Also, I do want to take this time to point out after 25 years of uh, childhood epicness, I wanted to say thank you very much to the character of Ash Ketchum and Pikachu for bringing such uh, classic and legendary moments to the Pokemon franchise. And I am actually looking forward to the new protagonist, see how they are going to be faring for their first time out ever in the Pokemon franchise. And I really, really, really do hope that the story is actually consistent or consistently progressive with uh, these two new protagonists and they don't go off course at any due point. So basically what I mean by that is uh, in inconsistently progressive. So they have w a leap one instead of just going skyrocketing and then all the way back down. I ho really do hope that these uh, new protagonists are gradually built up with uh, epic stories to boot. Ooh, excuse me. Whilst the uh, headmaster of the academy is enjoying a cup of tea with the mother of the protagonist, it is now time to go grab the rest of the uniform, and I believe it's also time to go make our way outside. And I do want to give an extra point out or 
quick extra heads up, ladies and gentlemen. I will also be including the DLC or the upcoming DLC for Pokemon Scarlet and or Violet, whichever one I'll be playing. And in this case, it's going to be Pokemon Violet. Already for the already for the first day. Oh, let's see how this is going to go. Oh, you've forgotten something else. Well, no time like the present. Let's see what uh, other matters you wish to show. Let us venture forth outside, ladies and gentlemen. Ah, yes, the very famous moment of choosing your very first Pokemon. The three Pokemon of the Paldea region. Sprigatio, that was the name. Yep, so this playthrough is also going to be serving as a prediction to what I believe is going to be the main, the full, or the full or complete team, whichever terminology for you, you want to use, for the uh, main protagonist of Pokemon Horizons. And seeing as how one of them has already been revealed, it's not going to be much of a surprise, but... That, uh, which one I'm going to be picking. And I do apologize about repeating myself. And um, also, I do want to give everybody a quick heads up. If you do hear me hesitating, stuttering, or struggling with any of my sentences throughout any of my videos, ladies and gentlemen, with me being an autistic individual, talking is not one of my strongest points, but I do try anyway. All right, the, then, so we've obtained the Rotom phone. Now let's have a quick wander around the house. Just a bit of bonding time with all three Pokemon. And then we will shall be making over making our way over to the oh, the house of the principal so we can actually decide so I can actually decide on which Pokemon I'm gonna be starting off with. Also, if anybody is new to my channel, ladies and gentlemen, I hereby welcome you. And if you do like what you see, please do myself a favor. Please consider hitting the subscribe button down below along with the bell so you can receive notifications for when new content has been released onto my channel. And whoever does consider hitting the subscribe button down below, you truly are a legendary individual, and it always helps my channel expand little by little every time you do hit the, hit the subscribe button down below. And if you are a returning subscriber, I hereby welcome you back, and I look forward to hearing what you think of the current video. And I'm also taking a bit of time to wander around the house, ladies and gentlemen, to pick up any uh, extra items that you might see just lying about, as I'm doing right now. Even though I'm not much of a water, per water person, ladies and gentlemen, you got to admit, just looking out at that scenery, absolutely stunning. Aha! Another item hiding over here, next to the bushes. So there's our destination. Oh, it really does suck. I can't. I have to go slow walking speed right now. Are you three getting on right now? All right, so I, the mini map has officially appeared, I believe. I wasn't paying attention much just now, but when is the walking speed going to be picked up again? Come on already. Finally, the walking speed is officially picked up about time too. Even though the slow walking speed is good for taking in the scenery, and in this case the Paldea region is just breathtaking to behold, my word, it does bore me to death because you just get the thought process of just, oh, come on already, I just want to get to places right about now. And here we are. We've officially arrived at the Headmaster's house. Oh, where'd they go? <laughs> Off doing their own thing. There's Quackle. 
just uh, relaxing in the pond, Spregatio, enjoying the green. Are uh, you hungry over there, Fue, Fue Coco? Oh no, I can see where this is going already! Oh, He's just looking like... Ooh! What's that? I wonder. And who's this then? Wish I could pick all three as uh, my starters, but unfortunately, no, I gotta only pick one. <laughs> okay, then, now it is that time once again to make the decision, ladies and gentlemen. After this trainer has finished talking. What if I am? If you want to get uh, the floor wiped with you in every single Pokemon battle you wish to ch issue to me, very well. Whoa, 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 hold your horses. I haven't even made my decision yet. Ay, ay, ay. Some people just need to hit the brakes. Indeed I have, and if anybody has missed what I've been uh, saying at the start of the video, ladies and gentlemen, my first Pokemon is going to be not Fue Coco, because I have done that in an off-camera playthrough. It is going to be none other than Sprigatio, the Grass Cat. So that is Pokemon number one for the team. And here's hoping that my prediction will actually... Uh, Ar uh, arise correctly. No, I'm not going to be giving Sprigatio a nickname. What can I say? I'm just a very likable person. And why is that such a shock to you? Aren't you, like, further ahead of me? And if you are, why on earth are you even asking to choose a starter Pokemon? Alright then, I wonder which Pokemon uh, Neoma is going to be... I hope I pronounced that name right, and uh, I do apologize in advance if I uh, I mispronounce the name. So then, let's see what the... Nimona... Oh, God. Oh, jeez. I... Brain is going into absolute meltdown. Quaxel. Or Quackly. Oh, I don't... Even... Oh, my brain is going into absolute meltdown right now, ladies and gentlemen. But anyway, I've chosen Sprigatio. Our newest rival has picked the, the water type, and I believe the fire type Pokemon is going to be staying with uh, the Headmaster. And on that note, ladies and gentlemen, that brings episode one of my Pokemon Violet playthrough to a cl close. I really do hope you all enjoyed it, so join me next time for when I head down to the beach and uh, have our very first Pokemon battle with our newest rival. So until next time, everybody, I've been ShadowStar91. Stay safe out there, take care, and I'll catch you all in the next episode of Pokemon Violet. Bye-bye.